Hey, what's up? This is Smooth. I'm gonna come stop by the gym, come train for a little while. I'll see you soon. Alright, so for one, I'm a huge Bendo fan, so it was a complete honor to train with him. And two, he's a fantastic wrestler and he's especially good when it comes to leverage. It's almost impossible to take him down because his legs are like fucking tree trunk. I weigh 100 pounds more than him and his legs are still bigger. It's incredible, but it was great in helping me train for the takedowns because I knew that my next opponent, he's very familiar with the gameplay I'm going to be bringing into the octagon. So I wanted to add another little wrinkle to the strategy to give him a look he hadn't seen before in our previous fights. And finally, I trained on my counter speed because if I could counter Bendo, I could definitely count on my opponent. Now, who's my opponent, you ask? None other than our good old friend Junior Sagano Dos Santos the Second Esquire. We're meeting in the octagon for the fourth time, and he's improved every single time. I don't know what's gonna happen coming into this one. All I know is that I have a right hook in the dream, just like I did when I stepped into the Ultimate Fighter all those years ago. Junior Dos Santos is gonna have to send me to the hospital to take this belt, and I don't have medical insurance, so I don't really feel like going there tonight. After this fight, the only thing that's going to be on his deathbed is Dos Santos' career. Let's do it. Coming up next, it is our main event of the evening between Big Train and heavyweight superstar, Junior Dos Santos. Junior Dos Santos. He's so old, I figured I'd be fighting his son by now. Junior Trey Santo, you knew I was you knew I was going there. Don't lie, you knew that joke was coming. It was terrible, but you knew it was coming. Anyway, all jokes aside, he's the first man I'm facing for the fourth time. So that means I know him well, but he knows me well, and he's done nothing but improve each time I fought him. He's actually level 98 now with a hundred stand-up, like 98 submission and like 95 groundwork. He's still just as dangerous as ever. And if I lax on him, if I lose my concentration, if I make one mistake, he's going to put me on the ground and walk away with my title. But I, I'm not going to let that happen tonight. Not only is he the first man to face me four times, but he's still going to be the first man I'm going to beat four times. We're in Chicago, Illinois. They call it the second city. He got two saints. He's going to need both of them to beat my ass tonight. Big Train's been training. I got the beard growing again. I didn't like that whole goatee. It wasn't wasn't working. The pedophilia, the George Zimmerman look, it wasn't working for me anymore. I had to get rid of it. Train with Bendo. He got me ready for this. I'm ready to take this title one more time. Home to New York. Celebrate. Have some burgers at Five Guys. Maybe some Jackson Hole. Maybe we'll go get some fun later. I want to knock someone out. I'm not the next big thing anymore. I'm the big thing. I've had the title for like 10 fights. I'm not next. I'm the. I'm current. Update that shit, UFC. Let's do it. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. The American is 32. The Brazilian is 40. Big train weighed in at 250 pounds. Dos Santos will have a three-inch reach advantage. With the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Dos Santos coming in at his belt 238. That's pretty light for him. Actually, no, that's, usually, that's probably usually where he fights it. I'm at 250, of course. Drop 15 pounds. I'm not as big as I used to be before that super fight. I got the conviction loaded up for Junior Dos Santos. He's felt it one too many times already. Actually, three too many times. He's going to be scared of it, but I'm still scared of him. It should be an interesting fight. Let's see what happens. Big train. Junior Dos Santos. Mad love, Junior. Mad love, Junior. We've grown up together in this ring. I know you. You know me. Just don't hit me too hard, alright? I don't want to lose this title. I only got like 10 fights left after this. I'm, I'm tiring tomorrow. Not tomorrow. I'm retiring soon. I just want to retire with the title. How about that? Going to the UFC Hall of Fame, the only undefeated the heavyweight champion ever. Well, not undefeated, but I, I've never been defeated the champion yet. That's for sure. Okay, okay. I see him. I see him. Oh, okay. Oh, he's telling me to kick his leg? I got you. Bam. 
Either that, he was indicating that he was going to throw that spinning kick to me. He saw that he was tapping his leg. Like, he wanted me to sit on his lap or some shit. What is this? Ain't time for that, Junior. Maybe after the fight. He, he's not He's not being the aggressor. I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to come in there and start being the aggressor a little bit. He's going to have to counter punch. I'll oblige him. Ooh. That two scoops. Panther big train combo. Hold on. Let me hit with that jab. Jab with straight. Oh. Okay. Let me take him down. Oh, shit. He don't want that. He's punishing my body so far. Damn. 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 Okay. I told you he's getting better each fight. And I caught him. There we go. That's what I do. When I start getting hurt, I like to reset the fight. Reset the freaking canvas right here. Reset the cage. Gotta show that ring generalship. Get a. Sometimes you gotta take a breather. Get back into the game. Oh, not punch. Corona Dos Santos. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Come on, Junior. Ooh. Ooh, Junior. Close the distance. Spinning elbow. Ah. He didn't fall for that one like the last man did. Let's hope I can get another knockout with that. It's my pants. Spinning elbow punch. Get out of here, Junior. You're too close, man. You're too close. Ooh, 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 ooh. He thinks I'm Randy Couture or some shit. He's just gonna knock me out with that hop choggy. Oh, oh, get out of here, athlete's foot. Junior's game. Junior's game this fight. I beat him quick the last two fight. Uh-oh. I spoke too soon. Oh, oh, he's hurt. He's down. Come on, come on, Junior. Damn it. Damn it. He's staying alive. He's like the Bee Gees. He won't like me. He won't let me mount up. Okay, go on. Come on. You hurt. I know you hurt. Come on. Bam. Ooh. This round turn, it turned in my favor. Oh, try to go for the hop choggy again. Get out of here. Ooh. Ooh. I can't get hit by too many of those. Ooh. Holy shit, these counters back and forth. He needs to stop punching me in the kidneys. If he punches me there one too many times, it's going to be a wrap. All right. All right. Can't get, can't get too, ah. Uh. He's freaking going away really fast. Come on. Even though he was like crawling away because the stomach hurt, I couldn't catch him. All right, first round goes to me. He barely survived that one. First round goes to Big Train. He was beating me early. I came back with the thunder. Made him feel it. He's feeling it right now. It's all in his stomach and in his head area. He's feeling it all over. He ain't too careful. He's going to feel it in his ass too. Let's take a look at some of the highlights from that round. Boom! That was the, that was the game changer right there. That Superman punch. Usually used to close the distance. That time I just used to put it right in his mouth. <laughs> oh, right, man, dad, man, love. I see. Oh, you can't just give me some respect and kick me in my supple stomach like that. Come on, man. You know I had the pre-fight meal. Ah, ah, ah! There we go. You hear that? The ambulance is coming for him. They know I'm gonna knock his ass out soon. It's gonna be a tragedy. Close the distance, damn it. Use his big ass leg to keep me away there. Now get out of here, Junior. Working that take down a little bit. Let's reset the cage again. No, oh, maybe. No, 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 no. You staying, Junior? 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 Junior, can you. Junior? Junior? Ah! Junior, can you stop punching me? Nah, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, he's working. Ah. Never, never went for this before. Come on. Come on. I can feel it. I can feel it. I was working on my joint submissions earlier, too. Come on. I can feel No! I pressed the wrong direction. It said down. I pressed up. I messed up. I had the submission there, too. I was wrenching that arm. I was about to break it. I was about to send it back to Brazil in the box. UPS, FedEx. Expedited delivery. He connects with the Superman punch. He's hurting me here. Let me work on the clinch. We, we work on this with Bendo. Bendo help me work on the clinch a little bit. There we go. Ow, 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 Junior. Shit. Alright, all right. he doesn't want to let me doesn't want to let me get that plum. Oh no, he got the plum. Shit. No, 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 no. You ain't getting that. Alright. Uh, uh, let me get the let me get the plum. I just want to touch the back of your head, Junior. There we go. That's all I want to do. Come on, ow, my foot, you bastard. This is what you get for hitting my foot. Get your stupid ass off me. Oh, that wasn't good. Let me back up here. Too overzealous. Close the distance. That went right through his face and he didn't even react to it. Is he like immune to my Superman punches now? 
Ooh, oh, okay. I honestly didn't expect him to withstand the onslaught this long. I need to go back and retool a little bit my strategy. He's digging the body now. Come on, Junior. He, he definitely has the, the damage advantage on me, too. I'm bleeding all over the place. I don't know what he hit me with to make it so, but my face is not looking good right now. Come on, Junior. I'm going for that leg kick again, you bastard. There you go. How about you throw another leg kick? Oh. He doesn't even want it right now. Ow, he does want it. <laughs> He's showing me he wants it. Okay. Boom, close the distance. Missed it. Okay. It's getting iffy. It's getting iffy all around. Oh, oh, he doesn't even, he don't even know what's going on right now. Come on, Junior. Oh, damn, what a round. I should have freaking finished that submission off. I had him, too. I had him rent. I was, I was rent the arm. I was about to eat it. I was about to take a bite out of it, too. It looked delicious. And I just messed up on the direction. I pressed up when I should have pressed down. That's, that was the difference. His own, he'd, be, he'd be in the hospital right now if I didn't press up. I'll just put him in the hospital anyway. This is my round right here. We're going to knock him out. Come on, Junior. Me and you. Oh, nice move. Nice dodge. Oh, I got some of that too, bitch. I can dodge. I can move. I got some lateral movement. Ooh, athlete's foot. Ooh. Joe Rogan's talking about how much I... That submission... <laughs> how good it was. It was so good I can't even speak English anymore. That's how good it was. Ooh. I, Throwing convictions like crazy now. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Come on, Junior. Bam! That's my panted move right there. Oh, that wasn't panted, but he's out. He's out. He did some damage. I got some blood. It's all over my chest. I don't know why I'm showing him my elbow. I kind of kicked him in the face. I didn't elbow him, but I'm still the champion. I'm right about that. I'm still the champion. Ooh, finally. Just boom, right behind the ear. Beautiful. Hit him on the button. Call him when, I didn't put the athlete's foot in his eye this time. I put it in his ear. That's a, He's going to have vertigo for at least a week after that. Look at this. Just all up in his ear. He might get some antibiotics. He needs some of those. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at one minute, three seconds of round number three. To play the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Martinez. Big train. Junior Dos Santos. I love you as a competitor. Love you as a person. But hopefully your career is over now. Please. That's four times. That's four times I knocked your ass off. Just stop trying. I need to find some new blood. I need to find. I need to find some new blood. My career's winding down. I need to get some super fights in here. I already beat you. I need some fights that are gonna bring in the money. People will never believe that you can beat me anymore, especially after four times. But you know what? Hopefully you retire. Maybe you get one more match, like knockout. I don't know Roy Nelson, and then fade off into the sunset. A winner. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> we got 12 more fights after this. 12 more fights, and not only that, the new career will be starting next week. Remember, I'm doing the poll of what weight class you want me to do the new career in. I have the link in the description if you guys want to vote on the weight class. That poll ends tomorrow night. And whichever one is in the lead, that's what I'm going to do the new career in. It is all for you guys. That second career is, is all for you guys. You guys are going to help me run it. You're going to help me make the champion. You're going to help me decide what style he is, what difficulty, what he looks like, his sponsors. It's going to be a lot of fun. So go and vote on that. I hope you guys are looking forward to the new career. Big Train ain't done yet, though. Still got a few more fights. I'm, my goal is to retire as champion and be the greatest UFC fighter of all time in the history of UFC and the history of the world. H greatest person in the history of the world. Big Train is still rolling. I hope you guys are still on board. I'm Big Ray and Y, and I'll see you on the next one.